Hi, I'm Skyler. Let's say you produce a lot of content for uh, social media or web marketing and your photographs have to be cropped to certain aspect ratios. It would be really convenient if Aperture had a way of creating a crop preset so you could very easily apply that particular crop to many photographs simultaneously. But unfortunately, it doesn't have a way of doing that. There is, however, a workaround that was posted by a really helpful guy, Thomas, at Aperture Expert. So I wanted to make a video about it. Here I am in Aperture. And I'm going to select an image, this one. I'm actually going to remove it from the stack first. Now I'm going to duplicate it. You can do this by holding Option and pressing V. Unstack these. OK, so I've got an image now. And I'm actually going to create a new album. You can do that by clicking as I did or holding down Command and pressing L. I'm going to call the album Crop Presets and make sure that Add Selected Items to New Album is copied. Click OK. All right, so now that's in the album. I'm actually going to create a folder too. Put this up at the top and put my crop presets in there. I'm going to give this number one. So I've got a folder full of presets, and this is crop preset number one. Now, one thing I want to make sure of is that there are no adjustments on the image. So highlight it and click Revert to Original. This is under the Adjustments tab. All right, so now I have no adjustments. Next, I'm going to crop. So Add Adjustment, Crop. Click Custom for the aspect ratio. And type in the pixel dimensions of the image you want to create. So for example, the Facebook banner, which is 815 pixels across by 351 high. So let's type that in. 815 by 351. OK. So you notice that it actually went way down. It was actually those pixel dimensions. So what you can do is click the Crop button. and Make sure that it's the aspect ratio. So now we can draw this out. And you'll see that I've got 4,896 pixels across. And I'm just going to crop the image where I want it, for the heck of it. Click Apply. All right. So now we've got an image cropped to the dimensions we want. But what good does that do us? Well, remember that it's the only adjustment on this image. And this image doesn't have a rating either. So let's say that I want to apply this crop to another image in my library. Check this out. Remember that you can lift adjustments. So you could either right click on the image and click Lift Adjustments, or you could use the shortcut. So hold down Shift, Command, and C. And that'll lift the adjustments off the image. Now go to your library and find an image. Let's use this one. To stamp the adjustments, you can either right click on it and click Stamp Adjustments. Or you can use the shortcut Shift Command V. There we go. It's the right aspect ratio. And all I have to do is press C and then reposition it in order to crop the way I want. So using this method, you could see that you could create a lot of presets for different aspect ratios very easily and save yourself the time of typing them in over and over again. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.